How's it going, Dokkan Ninja Turtles? We are here with some... Some stuff. Because, man, these, these banners are going to be dropping tonight. And I put up that poll. 73% of y'all said y'all still going for Broly. And, yeah, on the Gohan. So, I'm curious to see if that would actually change now. <laughs> I'm curious on that one. I, like, as a matter of fact, in the comment section below, let me know. Would you reverse that at this point in time? Because... Two videos, was it two videos? Maybe three videos ago. Whenever we got the actual information, I made that video. And I was like, uh, I don't know. Because I was like, don't get me wrong. Broly looks like he should be number one on paper. But Gohan is something that he could be something that the super side has been missing. Which is the crazy damage dealer. And yeah, I think I was right. Uh, because... You're not gonna probably run him on his only leader skill. You're definitely like even in this showcase, you're you're running. They're running him the new Super Saiyan trio. Like they're running him under them. Like and I was like, yeah, that's probably what's gonna happen. You're probably gonna have to have that. That way you can have go them be the trio, be the slot one, to go on being the slot two, getting more defense, getting more support, and just going absolutely insane. And that's what he's doing, dude. Like. This is a 54-minute showcase. The Broly is 46-minute showcase. And within the t first 10 minutes of the damn Family Kamehameha showcase, you can already see that Gohan is max damage rainbow. This is rainbow max damage. I'm very curious to see if he can hit max damage at a 55%. I'm very curious on that one because if he can on that one. And let me just so go ahead and say this right now. They have been glazing Gohan like crazy for, and this is a year now. It is a year now, okay? It is a year. Future Gohan, Beast Gohan, Family Kamehameha Gohan, and what are they all? STR, STR, STR. Who in there in the in the Dokkan headquarters? Who at Akatsuki has the biggest hard on for STR and Gohan? Who who is is it Omatsu is is this is is Gohan Omatsu's favorite character seriously, is it? Because that's that's not a coincidence that all of them have been STR dude. That is not a coincidence whatsoever at all, whatsoever at all, bro. I'm I'm being dead ass when I say this. That pay attention, okay? Pay attention. Pay a lot of attention because we got two tech bros, a new one and then one that got an easy A. Both tech, both tech, and it's like okay. What, what, what are we doing here? I I wouldn't be surprised for the 10th, because they have to, they, first of all, they have to outdo this for the 10th year anniversary. I would not be surprised if they pull the same crap for the um, countdown for the 10th year that they did for the 9th year with the mono leads, with the mono support leads getting their easy A's and actually being, you know, viable at that point in time. If the reason why we ain't seen no 120 uh leads get an easy eight or super easy eight yet because they they're gonna easy eight all of them in, in the 10th year like obviously they're, they're super easy obviously their leader skill won't go up at that point in time but i'm pretty sure they probably have something built in maybe even some more support and like i said I, i'm still i'm still putting money on the fact that we haven't even seen the type supports we haven't, we haven't even seen the type support banners come back i'm i'm putting money that you know scratch the super easy eight I'm going to go back to the original one and say that they might be putting the 200 or at least 170 uh, liters in the tight banners. Like just a tight unit right there, right then and there for mono. I wouldn't put it past it. I would not put it past it because they haven't been back on the JP side since January. And for us, it was what, June, late June, late June or something like that. I would not be surprised at all at this point in time dude because goodness gracious gohan is crazy first of all i know we're i know we're talking about gohan a lot on this one but the broly has got crazy dumb longevity as well too because we still don't have like every movie villain in the game and once we get more of the movie villains in the game and they're even giving more movie support and all this other stuff as well too with the extremes and stuff he's gonna have even more uh, longevity like he's a villain and he's a crazy dumb top tier villain like, matter of fact, both the Broly's are. I and mean, all three of the Broly's are top tier. Top tier. I'm curious to see how the ranking system currently is right now in Dokkan. Because 
I had my own ranking system that I put at now, and I might have to go back and revisit that and be like, bro, is is this Burley the best tank? Is is this Burley a better tank than uh, Vegeta now? Evolve Vegeta? I, I would I would assume, yeah. I mean, damn, I would assume the tech one is even better. So it's like, would that be Burley, Imp Burley, Tech Burley, and then Vegeta? For best defensive unit? And we all know damage dealer wise. Max. I don't I don't even care about the Burley down here uh hitting this much right there. I'm not even worried about that. Because if you can pop an active uh just about almost at any point in time, <laughs> or once you get all the dragon balls and stuff like that, once you once you do that and you pop that damn active and you just see through the roof. I don't think ain't nothing you can say anymore. I don't, I don't. I don't personally think there's anything you can necessarily say at that point in time and be like, yeah. But when I, once I get all these Dragon Balls, and which by the way, Bulma got even more uh, support. Matter of fact, that I would assume anyone that's changing orbs to types at this point in time now on this team uh, is even better for Super Saiyans because then that means you're just gonna get all the Dragon Balls easier uh, instead of only being able to collect three. Of the colors and stuff like that, you can literally, if you can get it changed to where it's multiple colors of the same and blah blah blah, like, like, it, it, even putting it in an item just to change the key spears, it, it, even for the item, is is even more value now because then you could take in. Now you could take in. You let me put it this way: you do not need any other when you're using this team with uh, the Goku uh, trio. Or I guess now you can really say the Trunks. No, no, no. Gohan Trio. I, I'd rather say Gohan Trio because Gohan's not in the other one. So if you're using the Gohan Trio, then you're running him. It's like you're probably not going to need items in any of these hard events right now. You're, you're not going to need items whatsoever at all. Let's just put it that way. You have these two on a rotation and you have him and then someone else on the rotation that's definitely in a slot two that can still do lore damage and defend and then you just have two floaters that are giving you more support and blah 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 like it's literally like it doesn't matter at that point it 100% doesn't matter you're probably not running items so I would say if you want to get like all of those dragon balls at, at one point because Gohan's going to be in the slot too so if you literally just technically I, I hate to say it but technically use the old nuking method to where you would just get it all in one and that's it. You can do. You can even use a new nuking method and just you know get a couple of them to change and stuff like that, depending on see how it is, see how that goes, and they have just only two, and then just go buck wild with that. Like you can do a lot. Like you can do a lot, bro, a lot uh, with this. Like the fact that like it's not even. It's not even limited to what you can do with the support. Like I'm, I'm curious to see. Like I, like I'm, I'm pretty positive somebody's gonna try that, and they're gonna hit max damage numbers all the time. Like even if at pro, and at that point, definitely probably at 55. percent Like you're going in at max damage and everything. Like, like I'm, I'm positive that I think if people could vote back again, they would probably go for the Gohan uh, at this point in time. And I think a lot of people. Uh, opinions and and have probably switched after even seeing the showcases of being like yeah i'm probably gonna go for gohan 100 and even though i'm yapping a lot right now i just want to say this real quick i know some people were thinking that jiren might be on the part two for the carnival which i was kind of like yo they probably need to put this fool in here because the longer we wait for jiren to come out the more you devalue jiren in my honest opinion like i like, hey, you can let me know if I'm wrong or not in the comment section below, but real shit, <laughs> like, if he comes out, like, mid-October or late October, or, God forbid, in, no in November, you know what? People are going to skip the high heavens out of him. Because then it's like, okay, at the end of January, the world, the anniversary is going to start. And I'm building Dragon Stones after this, after this, I can't... I want to say no content, but it's not been no content because we did get content in part two. It's just that we're better now and that we're, we can beat the content easier because we got units like this. So it's like we can literally beat the content quicker and quicker and quicker, which again, you know, Matsu, at the end of this, so in that thing, in that little uh, uh, survey that we're going to have to do, we're going to sit down and respectively talk and be like, listen, my God, uh, you're going to have to double the content. 
or, or at least uh, triple the damn content because Lord have mercy. You don't have to give us all Dragon Souls 24-7, but, I mean, damn, you need to give us some more tons of thanks tickets. You need to give us some more items, blah, blah, blah. Like, give us some more shit to really do because at this point in time, bro, like, we can run through this shit. We, we literally running through it. We running through it, especially if you got all the units, bro. We're running through it. And again, just harping back on this whole get this damn microphone, but harp back on the whole situation of where people are ranking these units at. I said this before and I say it again. The worldwide celebration is the massive power creep because the units have to be better than the anniversary because it's a six month gap. And I think we're all in attendance right here and saying like, yeah, yeah. Beast Gohan's probably not even the top five right now. I, I, if if you got Beast Gohan in the top five, then I mean, wh where? Because all four of these units, in my opinion, are better. And then you got Tech Broly that, I mean, he's not better defensively until he's super attacking and blah, blah, blah. Then, you know, he's all right. In the slot two or even the slot three, where you don't have to, like, if you don't have to worry about an AOE, which again, this is only subject because we're in this, uh, we're in this celebration where it's themed out and Broly's doing AOEs and stuff. If you don't have to worry about an AOE and then you throw Broly in the slot three, then he's going to be perfectly fine. You won't have to worry about him getting absolutely hit unless it is for a super attack. And at that point in time, he's probably already super attacked two or three times. So it doesn't really matter whatsoever at all. He's going to tank that shit. But I mean, if that's, that's like one of the arguments I guess you can have, but at this point in time, I mean, it's just like, we still don't have the other easy A's. We still don't have the super easy A, like the sub easy A. Like, we still don't have none of those as well, too. And I, we're all waiting on the sub easy A's. We're all waiting on the super easy A for the tech uh, Broly at this point in time. I mean, shit, we know. We should actually get something to probably get teased out with them either tonight, whether it be on the Twitter or on their official Twitter page or something like that after the banners are probably dropped. I would assume, if not, like, on login that they do it in in-game. I don't know. We'll just have to see. But... I mean, for the fact that these banners are coming out tonight and we get these show, like I said, the showcases, we knew it was going to happen. We knew we was going to see it. Like, bro, look at the, look, look, four, four hours ago, it's already at 36, bro. And I haven't even refreshed this. Like, I haven't even refreshed, like 38. <laughs> look, I'm, I'm pretty positive that most people are just going, I got the, I got the trio. I'm deaf. Like if you have the trio, yeah, you you probably really need to be going. I, I'm gonna be dead ass. You probably really need to be going for Gohan if you have the trio. Like even if you like, oh man, Broly's cooler and stuff like that, bro. For the sake of your account, like just go for Gohan at that point in time if you already have him. Like I don't have the trio, so I'm going for Broly. And then after that, then we'll see what happens. Because if you're close to a pity, or if you have a pity. Right now, if you sitting at a if you sitting at a petty system right now, you get you got the five hundred petties. <laughs> you're, you're probably getting go on right off the bat and not even touching his banner because first of all, his banner's got that tech Broly on it, and if you already have tech Broly and you have him Rainbow, you probably don't want to see that man in your summons ever again because like because he's gonna plague a lot of people. So he, if if you got the pity. Petty, the pity petty system. Uh, <laughs> you, you better be just go ahead and just pity this dude, and then you can focus on Burley at that point, Todd. But Lord have mercy, man. Goodness gracious. Also, uh, just a just a word of advice for all the people summoning tonight on Friday the thirteenth, unholy Friday the thirteenth. Um, if you get dusted, take a break. Take a break. Like, don't don't sit there and just keep taking it. <laughs> Pause. Don't sit there and just keep taking the shaft. Pause. I, I did that one on purpose at that point. But I mean, damn. Like, take a break. Go go on a walk. Go out there. Just be like this outside. Then I'll go back in. You know, do do something like that. But other than that, man, have an awesome day slash nice day safe. And I'm out. Peace. Yeah!